Hi everybody, today we're here at uh, Rosewell Flea Market. Let's get them in the background right here. Can you see it? Can you see it? Mandatory outfit check of the day what we're wearing. Let's get through it. Um, start at the top. Uh, Suavecito pomade. What else? Ray Bands that I found on the golf course. Shout out to you, whoever lost them. Apple Watch. <laughs> Apple Watch band, stainless steel, chrome hearts ring. 925 silver ring. Let me show you. Chrome hearts pendant, stainless steel chain, not silver, don't worry. Uh, the Pesh Moti from Privileged Vintage. I got way back 2001 tour. This is from the Exciter tour. Crazy back hit, just look. Good. I think I got this for $25, insane steel. What, what, what tag is it? Gildan Heavyweight Cotton. Oh, Gildan Heavyweight, the best. This is Gucci side bag. It's cool, it's nice, it's fun. Fits a lot of stuff, just open it right up. Wonder what the outfit, so I had to throw it on today. Next are these uh, Universal Threads brand, I think, you know, by Target. Got these second hand, amazing fit. I can't, like look how wide that leg is. Probably got them for like eight bucks because we got them at the racks. Super clean. You know, I didn't have to pay $80, $100, $120 for the ones that they sell here at Roseville. Um, and then Timberlands, black Timberlands, amazing shoes. Super comfy, way comfier than some Doc Martens. And I've been wearing, I've been daily wearing them this winter. So we're going to head in there. Thank you for watching. Hit the like button. Damn, not that, not that, this. Little C patch, 1962. Like a satin purple and beige bomber. I mean, varsity. Check this out. Never seen this one. I wonder if it's licensed. Dang. How much? Whoa. No tag, but very, very, very nice. Look at that. Look at all of these Supreme blanks, that's crazy. Got them in every color. A lot of them too. This whole table Supreme blanks. Sold, sold, sold. Here's a little locker. I like this height because you can still use it as like a little sh uh, shelf without it being too high. We got these guys over here. This one's nice. Is it cupboard? Ooh. This is solid. It's solid. Smooth. These old little rides. Oh, you just got them? Yeah, a little banner. They were 10 bucks. Nice, that's sick. Yeah. Want to check out this very old LA Dodgers hat. Damn, this thing is fragile. How old is this, Artem? Yeah. What, what? The Dodgers hat? 60s. Oh wow. Isn't that material wild? Yeah. Made in Japan. Oh, made in Japan. 
It feels like it was made out of an animal. Here's a tag, let's see what it says. Made in Japan, extra large. It's an extra large. How much does the hat go for? Um, it's going for like 60 bucks. Oh, nice. Wow. Cool, right? Yeah, that's crazy. Weird, like, patchwork on a leather jacket. Yeah. What, what, what era would it be? This was probably just the 80s. Oh. Yeah, I think. That's weird. I love it. Yeah, Brought a lot of hard goods today. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, Christmas gifts. Oh, yeah, exactly. That North Face is so cool. That's so awesome. Champion Olympics in the packaging still with the tag. That's cool. Deadstock. Deadstock Long Johns. Ooh, lots of Deadstock vintage. Turn that music off. Oh, wait. We saw this shirt. Remember? Mr. T-shirt from Pasadena? Yeah. I think we saw that t-shirt at his booth. Yeah, this is a dead stock one. These pants, such a good look. These blue ones, nice load of repairs. I just like how each repair was placed where it was placed. You dressed up the dog. Yeah, rub them for good luck. I like this, what is it, a Bengals jersey? Bengals jersey number eight, but no logos on it. I like that, super low key. I get it, it feels like maybe a number seven. It's my favorite number. I'll try to try this on, I'm gonna try it on. I'm gonna try this on. Is the angle good? Yeah. Oh, I should have took my glasses off. How is it? Uh, turn around, I'm gonna come by. Bye. Good luck in January. Can you see the whole body? It actually fits perfect. Yeah, it does. It's really good. I don't need it. We have too, too many clothes. But I just love how there's no logos on it. Super clean. Oh, and the sleeves are chopped. One is chopped, one is not. Thank you. What's the asking price on the center check? Uh, 150. Nice. 150. Super clean. Yeah, I like the clothing. Probably the oldest framed photo I've held. You can guess the year 1891. Age 16. And 1888. Anyways, got some Arctic sneakers. The Conceal FLs. Probably waterproof. Oh, what the Vibram sole. Look at that. This is like a, a flyer or something from 1882, Arizona. I like that display. Yeah. You know that display that uh, Enya has in her podcast? I want something like that. Yeah. The red one, the red shell. Yeah. This one's not deep enough, unfortunately, but I need something for the wall. I haven't found one here, because I've been looking. Mm. I've been checking. 
just found this. This is like your size perfectly without it being too small for a kid's size. Yeah. It's a really good print, screen print, single stitch. Looks like it was a Screen Stars tag. Artem, how much is this one? Uh, Gotta pay up for the true vintage Hello Kitty. Clean little Nike shirt made in Turkey. I didn't know it was made in Turkey. I like this one. The neckline is just looks super perfect and crisp. Single stitch, embroidered. Ooh, this one's crazy. This is a six box character, right? Animal RX LA. Like Animal Hospital? That's cool. I need that. If I had a six box pass, I'd wear that. Wow. That Yankees script font is so sick. I like this one, this Porsche hat over here. Nice. Snapback. Yeah, these are, I've never seen these before. Super interesting pair. Levi's with the front pocket and the tab in the front. I don't see that very often. They're not that old. Made in Turkey. It's like an 80s, 90s tag. Probably 90s. Or 80s, no, definitely 80s. I'm also guessing, but super good cut. A little flared at the bottom. I also like this pair. I like the orange and the pockets, I like the stitching on the pockets. All right, this is a really good one. On the Champion Sportswear, wait, hold on. On the Champion Running Man process sportswear UCLA I think this is like the neckline and the stitching and the sleeves and the cuffs and the gusset and all that it's like a 50s 60s one but I'll get, I'll get confirmed I'm gonna ask him I'm curious what this is dated Heard it from the man himself, 1950s. Oof, I should ask the price. Wait. Running, what's the running price on this? Uh, 220. 220, nice, uh -huh. cool. That's a fine. If this was a USC one, I'd definitely cop. And if it was one size bigger. Beautiful. Though. Too small to try on, but I'll just hold it up so you can see it. See the vision. It's a pendant I really like. This one right here. 925 silver. Skull with the stars on it. it says 925 stamped right there. Super fine. Beautiful stitching. Good colors. Here's the tag. Styled and tailored in California. Very nice. Even the sleeves. That's cute, the little heart. I love this color in the FFA. Need one in this color. Oh, no back hit. I have one I found. Glad I didn't sell it. I actually tried to sun fade it, which was a bad idea. I wish I just kept it original. A crazy shirt. Never seen this tag before. 
loud room. They glow. Is that a jaguar? We got a almost satin material FFA jacket on a champion. That's nice. A little chain stitch. Another one. I didn't know they made them on these champion jackets. Oh, there's a bowling jacket. Bowler's uniform. Los Angeles. Chain stitch. Open division. Satin. Wow, 1970. That's cool. Bob, I think we saw this one last time. Nope, we didn't. 1957. Super thick. Germany, 1959. Reversible. Unzip that a little bit. Oof. That's crazy. Shout out to Bob. Oof. That's a funny one. Looks like a, if Ermin Miller designed a shirt. Looks like his logo. 1950s 200. Can we cash out on that? Oh God, yeah. Las Vegas. Authentic Western shirt. Little Japan Sukajan. Mayo jacket, Penny's Town Craft shirt. It was 1935, probably. Zipper, Town Zip. Whoa, the New York University. That is tough. <laughs> Sleeves. Oh, one tw oh, okay. I was like, 120, not that bad, but it's 1,200. All this New York University jacket I've seen. Is his name Les, or did he live in the LES, Lower East Side? I don't know. NYU patch, pockets, with the tag inside the pockets. Ben Mar uniform, there's a crazy one. Reversible, probably not. Nice little buttons. It's amazing. Now I wonder what the year is on that one. Look how cute this little jacket, little jacket is. Reminds me of some capital. Oh, this is Billy the Kid. Obviously, this is an inspiration for capital, I assume. I like that, though. Little star. Wrangler, blue bell, tiny jacket. A nice little hippie shirt. Hey, Tommy. What's the year on that New York jacket? Uh, it's like 40s. Oh, wow. That's amazing, man. It's the oldest NYU jacket I've ever seen. Oh, man. <laughs> have, have you seen many? I haven't really seen many. No, no, no. Little buckle back type one vest, type one, I think. 
right? One pocket. I'll go back here. This Tenacious D t-shirt. It's crazy. Long sleeve, actually. With the armadillo. Some leather jackets. Go through these real quick. Ooh, that one is so clean. That's amazing. I love the two pockets. Oh wow, why did I not know this is where the belt goes, these little loops? <laughs> I always wondered. Now I know how to style it. Genuine horse hide jacket. The red guts. Levi's jacket, good color. This booth is so cute. That's California Republic tag, that bear service sign. This thing is huge. Double sided. I got an Arco gasoline stall sign. That's funny. This looks like a vintage U Haul. Cameraman. All right, for the first time in a long time, I found something in the trash at the flea market. It's like Stonehenge statue. Babe doesn't want it though. It's cracking anyways. It was funny. Super heavy. Are you gonna take it home? No, no, if it's all you, if you yeah, want it. Cool. Oh, well, well, watch out that crack though. It's cracked right there. Oh, is it? Oh, it's coming apart. Found a new owner. Congratulations. <laughs> That's funny. I, I had to let him have it. He always lets us come through and film. So, it was mandatory I give it to him. Last stop, checking out these mushroom displays. So sick. The candy canes. All right, y'all, quick little vlog today. Pretty packed up. Next flea market is Long Beach. Haven't been there in a while, but we will be there.